Vou acabar o Dani Mitten. Vou acabar o Dani Mitten. Vou acabar o Dani Mitten. Those were just a few of the prisoners moments after they met with Public Security Minister Kemrat Ramjitan and Minister of State Joseph Harmon on day three of the prison riot which re-erupted this morning as a new day was dawning over Guyana. More than a dozen inmates descended the stairs of the prison officer's sports club and as they were being returned to the jail, took questions from media operatives. Ministers Ramjatan and Harman appeared shortly after to brief reporters on what is actually frustrating the prisoners. That they had quite a lot of grievances, grievances with the conditions of the prison, grievances with some of the officers of the prison, grievances to do with the lengthy detention periods that, that they are in, not having trials. Some of them feel that they have grievances against also certain magistrates and judges. And um, some of them have a, a different story as to what caused the entire incident. But it doesn't end there. The prisoners are also requesting opportunity to meet with the media. I think they, al they also had an opportunity, probably while it's passing just now, to talk to you guys. As a matter of fact, one of their comments too was that they would like to meet the press on occasions. They want an extension of the two opportunities per week to talk to their family. They would like to meet their family lots more through the phone, that is, be allowed to talk, and um, a number of other things. All of which, cumulatively, they say, have harmed them to the extent of, you know, getting vexed. Ramchitan assured that government will be heeding some of the requests of the prisoners almost immediately. The kind of um, food they said they were getting, um, we can make that arrangement, that could be done quickly. Um, the, the other arrangements to phone their family, we could probably have more phone calls made to their family as, uh, and, and, and things like that. Those things can be done immediately and I have a list of them. I will recommend um, that a number of them which could be done. This has raised the question of whether it makes the government look weak to meeting with and eventually giving in to the demands of the prisoners. But neither of the ministers think so. They have given us a commitment that when they get back into the prisons that they will speak to the other prisoners to ensure that there is no further escalation in what is taking place uh, this morning. So I think we have um, a sort of a gentleman's agreement on both sides and we are going to try to keep our end of the bargain and they are going to keep theirs. It was reported to the media that the prisoners have different accounts of what actually led to yesterday's riot that killed 17 persons. But one thing is for sure, many are doubting the logics of prison officials that the men lit the fire, then refused to come out of the burning building. But Basel, as we've heard, a three-panel inquiry is being set up to investigate the saga.